Hi, it's Angeline. Welcome to another crafty video with Unity Stamp. Today I'm going to show you how to apply some flock transfer sheet with a glue pen to your card. So I'm starting off with the Here at Last stamp set by Unity Stamp. And here is a fun cutout with a die from Avery L, which is the oval burst die. And I've used some flamingo pattern paper here for my card. So I'm grabbing some Decofall Flock Transfer Sheets here in pink and white and I'm going to apply it using my Zig 2-way glue pen here. You can use any adhesive that you have but I like this pen because it can go into the tight and tiny spaces as you can see on the baby's blankie here. So once you've got the glue all over the places that you want, it's time to grab your Flock Transfer Sheet here pretty side down and grabbing my bone folder and just giving it a nice good rub. And as you can see, the flock transferred really well on the card. And if you are afraid you've missed any spots and it looks too crazy, make sure you colour in the stem first as I did with some Copic markers or any colouring markers that you have. So here I'm just doing the same with the white flock transfer sheet and again using my bone folder and just pressing the flock down to my cardstock. Now it's time to assemble the card so I'm just putting some glue right behind the die cut that I've done and I'm just going to align it to my baby's cardstock and then placing that on my card base. Next, I wanted to add some glitter, so I'm grabbing some Newell glitter drops here to add some dots around the baby. So here is a close-up of my card. I wish you can feel and touch the flock because it is so fuzzy. It is so fun to add this to your card. So here is my finished card. I hope you enjoy this technique and thanks for watching. Bye!